Hello my beautiful and my handsome Aquarius. This is Aqua Goddess coming to give you all a general reading. Keep in mind that this reading will be for past, present, future and it may or may not resonate with you. If you're interested in booking a personal reading with me, you want to purchase any of my artwork or manifestation jewelry, or if you just like to donate to the channel, the information will be in our description box below. Also guys, don't forget to check out our second channel. I put some information on our community page in regards to that. <clears throat> so make sure you go check out your collective reads, like, share, subscribe. I've already prayed and meditated over your energy, so we're just going to go ahead and tap right in. Holy Spirit, angels, ancestors, guides, please protect me while channeling the messages for the sign of Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Note. Please return all negative energy back to sender 10 million fold and anybody out there showing me love. Much love and light to you. Spirit, what are the messages that we have for my beautiful, my handsome Aquarius? unhappily married so this could be you and your partner if you are married to this person things may not be going well right now or this could be third party and you know I would have to pull more cards and clarify okay vengeful unbothered so all right so i'm definitely feeling like in this connection you know someone plays a victim they don't know how to really talk out their feelings but they are rebellious so this is get back energy this person is an emotional manipulator you know, they may do things that are wrong that they don't want to take accountability for. So they emotion, emotionally manipulate you. When things don't go this person's way, they are very rebellious and vengeful. So they may do things to be disloyal or they will just act unbothered and don't resolve situations. They don't take accountability for things. This person has a bad reputation with you. I feel like they left a very bad taste in your mouth. There could definitely be legal issues. This could be speaking about a divorce. And definitely co-parenting issues. So this could result into child support uh, or just separation to where you have a custody battle. Things of that sort are coming here. There's a sense of somebody being stuck up. Um, this person is a fake influencer, so they could have a platform, but they may not. They may not live by what they preach, if that makes sense. I see that some of you all may be having a cyber bully. You could have someone online on your platform being disrespectful or just pushing your buttons. Being judgmental as to something that you have going on or something that you're doing. You don't care what people think about your goals or your creative endeavors that you're doing. You're still moving forward regardless. Angel number 404. Fishing for compliments. So this person may be an influencer not to help others, but to be basically a clout chaser. Their intentions are not pure behind what they're doing. Um, so this is somebody that does something for a paycheck or something. They're not really passionate about it or they don't really practice what they preach. There's someone that's chasing you. You could have already pulled your energy back from this person. They just seem to not want to leave you alone. This person likes you to boost their ego. They like to get compliments. They like to know that you care. Yeah, 
yeah, they feel connected to you. So it's like, even though they self-sabotage, they play the victim, they're vengeful, they still feel a connection to you. All right, what else for my Aquarius? Illusions. Yeah, so this person could be 34. They could be around that age. This person, um, they've run out of time when it comes to you. You feel like this person has gaslighted you a lot. You know, um, they made it seem like you guys could build something, but then they turned out to be a master manipulator. Devotion is in reverse. So you feel like this person doesn't show you the same loyalty. You can't trust them or their decision making, their decision making at all. And I see that you are focused. This person is definitely focused on making your reputation look bad when you guys go to court. So if this resonates for you, you guys may have a court date here with legal issues. And this person is going to focus on making you look bad in court. You will win this case. No worries. What else for my Aquarius? No communication. So you stop communicating with this person because you feel like all they do is lie, manipulate, self-sabotage, give you false hope. You guys have not discussed a way to make things better because you feel like it's a waste of time. And that there's nothing that this person can offer you anymore. Yeah, you completed the cycle here with the world card. You feel like you're giving it too much time and things have not progressed. You know, you went in this situation with the hopes of accomplishing some things. Succeeding on this journey with this person. Traveling the world together. Right? But the communication is off. You know, and this person wants you to put more in than they're willing to put in. Secrets have been exposed about this person giving time, money, energy, sex, whatever to someone else. Yeah, and it's caused a breakup. You're rejecting this person because they broke a bond, a devotion, a commitment. This is someone that you thought that you would have a forever with, that you would build investments with. You know, this is someone that you wanted to build a future with. You guys may be getting some news about money and inheritance, uh, something of that sort through your family or contributions. You're going to be getting an apology from this person that broke up from you. They want to apologize for wasting time. And it's because this person has been impatient with... they. This person has a hard time taking accountability, but they expected you to come forward by now and try to mend some things. You have not. This person is planning to come towards you and apologize for this, whatever they've done to manipulate you. They made you feel insecure in some kind of way. Yeah, you definitely have your guard up. This person put you in a competitive situation. You're protecting your energy by any means necessary. You feel like this person is very stubborn and unreliable. They make you feel stuck in this connection and you've lost passion. There's definitely a strong sense of misunderstanding here, a lack of direction. Um, a sudden shift in this connection. <clears throat> Could be with the Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. You feel like this person nags a lot. You know, there's a lot of conflict with this person. They smother you. 
they're obsessed with the status, but they don't want to put in the work to keep things going. Could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio for some of you guys. You got legal issues twice. Definitely a court date, child support, jail, some type of issues with the legal. Marriage. Yeah, this is a divorce here for sure. You guys have assets or something that needs to be split. You guys are going to have to go to court for that. You make me feel unwanted. Why don't you show me attention and affection? So there could be, it could be just a dry connection. Um, where you feel like this person doesn't match your energy. You feel blocked out emotionally from this person. You could have physically blocked them. I'm hearing unblock me. You guys have been getting that for a while. So there's quite a few people that you've blocked that miss you and want you to unblock them. But I see you're rising. You're focusing on the bigger picture here. Trusting your intuition. Somebody's falling in love with you, Aquarius. I don't know if you know this or not. Um, this could be for future if this has not happened, but I got I'm falling in love. So someone's definitely falling in love with you. It could be a Virgo Taurus Capricorn. This past person reaches out to mutual friends to give messages to you because you may have blocked them. Your intuition told you to block them. You felt like things were boring. I see lawyer, so some of you guys might be getting a lawyer or you may need to because this person is a manipulator. And I told you that they're trying to dig up dirt on you. Because there's a lack of growth here. You're waiting for some type of clarity or they're waiting for some type of clarity because they miss you. But this person is still manipulative. Um, <clears throat> There, this could be a narcissist. They have a lack of morals, a lot of illusions here, and selfishness. This person causes a lot of confusion. They're really shameful of the things that they've put you through. You guys could have been together for years, but you're just completely burnt out with this person. You feel like there's a lot of things that this person could do as far as their potential and their talent, but they lack that. They're always focused on the wrong things. This person is very untrustworthy. Um... They're overconfident, but they're very insecure. All right, what else for Aquarius? You could definitely be pampering yourself more. You're definitely working a lot. You may be wearing yourself kind of thin right now. Needing to get more sleep. Feeling like you always got stuff to do. Some of you guys are into tarot, spiritual advising, something of that sort. I see you got a real strong intuition. Or you could be meeting someone new that's going to fall in love with you. And this person may be a, a spiritual leader or a spiritual teacher. This, new, this old person is going to be very bothered about this new person because you could have kids with this old person. So they're going to still have some type of connection towards you to where they're going to know eventually about this new person, even if you don't mention it. This new person is going to be very loyal to you. They don't want to run the streets or have multiple partners or anything like that. This is not a drama person, so they may not be very confrontational. Uh, this is your karma, um, you know, for trusting your intuition. This past person, though, um, they could be a uh, Cancer Pisces Scorpio. This person wears a mask. They're going to be exposed for who they truly are. They're going to be serving bad karma. Justice will be served. This person is a master manipulator and they tried you. You're very protected. They should have never done that. This person will be facing major karma. You're going to be manifesting a new love, a new career opportunity, more money. Things are going to work out in your favor as far as these legal issues are concerned. And I see that you're just going to be trucking along. 
So those are the messages that I have for you, my beautiful Aquarius. If you enjoyed this reading or if it resonate with you, please make sure that you like and subscribe to our channel. And I will see you on your next video, love. Peace.